Hi guys, welcome to the Sunday vlog. <laughs> today we're going apple picking, and I wasn't gonna vlog today, but Amir made me pick up the camera, so I'm vlogging. Yep. I think I wanna start off this video though by saying thank you. I literally have the best subscribers ever. I had so many of you guys reach out to me since my last video that I made in dedication of my mom, and I just feel a warm heart. Um, you guys are really the best and I know my comments are turned off and it's so hard and I wish that I could interact with you guys more and I reached out to YouTube again this is like the second or third time I've reached out to YouTube asking them to turn my comments back on because I've literally, literally tried everything on my end to turn my comments on and I can't so I think it's something on their end um, but a lot of you guys reach out to me via my Instagram, which is always linked down below, and through email, which is also always linked down below. So I got a lot of response from you guys in the last, last vlog in regards to my mom, and I just want to say a quick thank you to everyone because it really does mean so much to us. Amelia and I are twinning today. We both have our jean jackets and mine's more like a burnt orangey shirt and hers is a red shirt but we're wearing black leggings and I love having a little girl because you can do fun stuff like this. I'm but not, we're going and I'm twins. Right. Daddy is not matching Isaiah but he still looks super handsome today. Hey, it's a nice fall crisp day out so I just figured it'd be a good day to get out of the house and do something fun as a family since we're all off today. Sundays are my new day off with my mom. She's got people scheduled on Sundays so that I can actually have one day off to do something fun with the kids like this and I'm so thankful. I know my last couple vlogs have been kind of like more serious with my mom's stuff but I wanted to make just a fun video for you guys today with us getting out of the house so we're excited. Yep, we're gonna get in line for apples first, I think. Okay. Then we'll see what else we can do. Egg. <laughs> yeah, he picked them himself. You're right. Let's pick gallows because those are the best. Looks like there's some good ones to pick. Enjoy Go ahead, Mio, grab a bag. Yes, absolutely. Thank you. You're very welcome. <laughs> Pick it if it's good. Got a good one? <laughs> this got to be another good one. There it is. Perfect. It's a tradition that we go every year here apple picking and then we make apple crisp at home. Uh-huh. After, right Mio? Yeah. Are you gonna help me make it? Uh-huh. I'll add this to your bag. Perfect. Girls team boys team. Girls team boys team. Let's go, Molly. Daddy's the official oh, the lifter upper. Yeah. Wow, Zaya. Get another one. Good job. One, one more time, Zay, you can do it. Come on, Zay, get it. Nice and strong. There we go. Woo! Good job, buddy. Hey, oh my gosh, Miel, you found a ladder. That's perfect. Oh boy. Amir literally <laughs> climbed this big, hey, huge tree. Careful, Amelia, not as high as dad. And there's Isaiah down below. Zaya wants to find all the perfect apples. I need Dad. Daddy will help you. Did you find one, Isaiah? Look. Did you find one? Good job, buddy. How's your apple? <laughs> Good. Mm. More. More juicy one. Mm. 
fresh off the tree. So good. Tricky words for school. We're gonna so, lay in bed. So. Good, Amelia. What? Cody doesn't have bug bites on his tail. Yeah. That's probably a good thing. This is Ma. all. You, what? You can't get one of these out. You can't get one of these out. Yeah, we can't. Right. They're not for the house. They're, right they're not for the party. They're, they they can have them now. Thought they were. I thought they were, right, Mom? Right. They kind of look But they have pumpkins! They have pumpkins? Yeah! <laughs> they have monsters on them. Okay, yeah. Sam. Here's your, here's your peanut butter and jelly. Let's show you guys our new blinds in our bedroom. This is the window that Cody likes to um, perch himself on, and his claws literally, like, destroyed our last blinds. So, I don't know why this is so dark. There we go. Um, we bought some blinds and we hung them. So for the day, I think I'm just gonna tie them here and then at night, obviously we let them down. But I think they look super cute in the room and they kind of just make it look more of a modern space. So the family's just chilling right now. Amir is cooking in the kitchen, prepping some breakfast for the rest of the week for himself. And I have some people coming over, a friend of mine. I'm going to do a bleach bath on his hair and then um, from here, we're probably gonna spend the rest of the day making dinner and hanging out with some friends, maybe. So, I'm gonna take a quick break. <laughs> can you tell someone's at my house? We're gonna take a quick break from the camera so I can do this hair, it won't take long, and then we'll be back. It's like eight o'clock at night. Um, our people left a little while ago. We hung out for a while with them, so. I lost a good chunk of the day here, but we just finished dinner. I made fajitas, chicken in our little air fryer here, and Amelia just took a shower. I cleaned up the house a little bit, and I'm about to start on these dishes here. The rest of the agenda for the night is I have to get Amelia's school backpack ready for tomorrow. And oh, I have to show you guys what I did this week. So I discovered um, the home edit on Netflix. I'm sure a lot of you guys have by now, but you know already that I'm obsessed with home decor and organizing and everything. So this was literally right up my alley and I am completely obsessed with this TV show. So I've been doing some light organizing. I call it light organizing. My house was pretty organized in the first place, but we took it to the next level here. So <laughs> I'll show you guys um, what I did. Let me flip the camera around here. Okay, so this cabinet has already been organized, you know. Um, I've got like our, our snack covered here. and We've got our containers and I kind of color coded. I mean, it's not really anything special, but this was already like this. I did add a Lazy Susan up here, which Amir has already <laughs> messed up. 
but that's okay. Um, I have to figure out something better for our spices because they drive me nuts and they're on the top so they're constantly hard to see and I have to get up on my tippy toes or a chair to see them. So if you guys have any suggestions of how I can better organize this area, let me know. Um, but anything that's not a spice but has to do with cooking per se, I'm keeping up here and we've got like this little lazy Susan. So that's an update. Um, this is still the same down here for snacks. So this cabinet in here was kind of like our catch-all for anything cooking and spices. We've got our pantry, but we keep a lot of the essentials up here. So um, we had a lot of cans down here and it was just a mess. So I did post a picture on Instagram if you guys saw that, but I'll show you um, what it looks like. Ta-da! It's beautiful. I bought myself a label maker <laughs> at Target. It was only like $17. It's the DYMO, the Demo Letra Tag, and it's super easy to use. Um, so I labeled these, and I got these little clear containers at Walmart. So we did like some rice, oats, two kinds of pasta, chocolate chips, and brown sugar up here. These are just mason jars. Then we've got our lemonade and flour. And then we've got a bigger Lazy Susan that has um, some of our essentials in there. And then down here we've got some lunch options. So we have the cup mac and cheese. The kids really, really love cup mac and cheese. We've got box mac and cheese for when friends come over. We've got soup. And right now we've got the ramen chicken flavored noodle soup. Then we've got oatmeal. Amir really likes to have oatmeal in the morning and the kids um, are starting to get into that as well. Amir's G and C supplements and then a lot of our um, like vitamins and supplements over here on another Spin Lazy Susan. So everything's organized. Anything extra from both of these cupboards are in the back pantry. I also organized our cupboard in here which it's so hard to keep organized you guys but um we just got different compartments for everything basically these scissors are too big they don't fit in here all the way but they're supposed to be in here but everything is pretty much organized let's see if it'll show oh it did that time let me put this guy away okay one last thing I'll show you is Amir and I have a very small closet for the master bedroom here. Like very small. So I organized the closet a little bit. I color coded our clothes, which they already were kind of by color, but not like color coded, I would say. Then I bought some white baskets at Target for the shelf above our clothes that we keep our pants in. Um, it looks nicer, I think, and it's easier just to grab the basket and go through what you want in that section like we each have a jean basket we each have like a shorts basket we each have i have a leggings basket and he has like a pajama basket you can just grab the basket and go through it and then put it back up top so i'll show you here's the white baskets these were the cheapest ones that i could find um at target because baskets are like ridiculously priced i think but um, that would fit like on our shelf. So inside here, jean, Amir jeans. I think there's my jeans up there, my leggings. But it does look like nicer from afar. And then I'm trying to change out our um, clothes hangers. I can't even think. Um, mine right now are all black. And Amir's are pretty much all white. There's some gray in there, but I would like to switch everything to black eventually. And then I've got to clean out under our closet. And I've got a growing amount of laundry to fold, which will probably be tonight's task. Yeah. That's all you had to do? Yeah. Well, you also need the word I a no so of. Those are your tricky words you gotta know for tomorrow. Do you have no? Yeah. You didn't have that one. Goes right there. Good. 
And then we shut this. No, I want to. We push it down. Good. Let's the dog, shut please. this whole thing. Or Hang on. Do you want yeah, me to and then walk? push this button right here. Good. Good helper. It's about that time of the night. We are drinking some White Claw in our dollar store Halloween hand mug or floret. Cheers. Every day I'm looking for a way to return to the town when everything was easy to learn. Don't know when it started to get so serious. Building up an illusion of a world full of trust. Moving on when everything's gone. Be strong. Confusion in my mind. No way to turn back time. My soul in need of remedy. Don't even know the enemy. When I feel out of touch, can't seem to get enough. Lights out. I'm gonna put Amelia's corn pillow in and take mine out for the night. Put your corn pillow in so when it beeps, it's ready, okay? Okay. Read a book or practice words, and then I'll be in after I put Zay down. Okay. Do you guys want to read a book together? I want to read a book. Okay. Yeah, book. Amelia's going to pick out a book and then meet us in Isaiah's room, okay? Come on, Zay. Mom, I will choose. No, Ia's going to pick. No, my book. What did you do to this drawer, Isaiah? Oh my god. Here we go. Alright, you can each pick one book. Okay, I've got the white claw and the corn pillow. And Amir made our bed with our freshly cleaned sheets, so that's nice. Um, my oil candle thing is going here. This I bought recently at Target, and it makes the room smell so good, and it gives a nice, like, nighttime um, light for this room. But I am going to turn on, maybe, the TV. What's going on here? Why won't you work? Oh. Isaiah, of course, unplugged the TV to plug his cars in, probably, here. So, let's see. There we go. Oh, I've got to take my makeup off soon. And I'm going to watch a little home edit, or I've been thinking about maybe... Um, maybe watching Ratchet, that new, like, I think it might be scary, I don't know. Um, it's with that actress from American Horror Story, though, so I've been thinking about watching that because I'm getting more into, like, the fall Halloween vibe recently. So, um, I'm gonna fold some laundry. <laughs> I say that literally every single night to myself that I'm going to fold laundry and then I end up just laying here on my phone or watching TV. So we'll see what happens. But I also am going to get my planner out and plan for this new upcoming week since tomorrow's Monday. All right, you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it's been a while since I've done just a normal vlog because I've been doing a lot with my mom and... Um, it's basically my life now so <laughs> thank you guys so much for being troopers and sticking with me through all this i know my channel has been on a journey and is continuing to go on a journey 
but um, buckle up because we're in it for the long haul here. So I love you guys so much. Don't forget to find me on Instagram so that we can connect since comments are turned off and um, like this video, share, I don't know. <sighs> I hope everybody had a good night and I will catch you guys in my next video. Mm. Love you all. Bye. Stumbling out of bed and I still got you in my head From all those pretty words you said It's like I'm wasted Every time I see your face I'm losing track of time and space I don't know where I am It's like I'm wasted And I won't waste it